Hello, so we are back and this time just reaction on that video that Alex posted against Sorin from Electronic Repair School. I am Maz, one of Sorin's students and I would like to give you my opinion. Alex, talking like that, it's obvious that you don't know Sorin at all. So let me explain you who is Sorin and what he is doing. At the beginning of his channel, I believe he had uh, less than 500 subscribers when I found him. At that time, I didn't know anything about motherboards, how they work, how to diagnose, how to anything. So I watched that guy and curiously, this guy gave me the wish more than that, the love to learn how to fix them. And sorry, he's not a kind of a showman who needs to prove or to show, look, I can do this, I can do that. He has nothing to prove. We all know he has a big knowledge about electronic repairs, but he has also something special, a big ability to teach us how to do it yourself. And this is very special. And beside of this, for those who knows him, they know what I'm talking about. He's a very straight guy. No matter your level of skill, of knowledge, even a very beginner who doesn't even know what is a MOSFET, what is a capacitor, he will never judge anything, anyone. He will explain you why you are doing it wrong way and this is how you can do it in the right way. At my beginning, when I found Sorin, I very quickly got addicted to his video. I was waiting for a post. Obviously, he did not post every day. I began looking for somebody else for fixing. And then I found you, Nordrich Fix. And what I saw is a guy with a very good skill of soldering. But actually, I did not learn anything from your video. This is not personal. This is my experience. I saw a lot of things on your videos, but I did not learn anything from your video. And then I did not follow your videos. And you are talking about numbers of subscribers. What does matter is the relationship. Sorin has a very solid relationship with his community. If he has any questions about anything, he just go and ask them and there will be a huge amount of people who are ready to do everything to help him. And this, to become on this level, I don't think he's a bad guy. Alex, I don't know your motivation, why you did this, but I think you choose a very wrong person for a critic. Sorin is a high level of, humanly speaking, knowledge, very good ability to teach and never judge anyone. And the proof of this is his community. They are ready to give blood for him. And this is a proof of the solid relationship that he has with his community. I know it's a very strongly said, but there is something special. I can assure you that. I am one of his students. If you want to have a look in on my channel to see what I have learned from him, be welcome. You can even critic me, no problem. All the critics are welcomed. This was my opinion. Nothing personal in this video, just the fact are speaking by themselves. Thank you for watching and see you on the next one. Bye. And bonus bonus. I just saw your secondary video. I thought maybe the first one was a some kind of a accident. That day you woke up and you just fell on your head or something, you know? But no. You did it again. Why, Alex, you need to go and shout out on other people. Why? Does it make you feel better, greater or something? Why you need that? Why? Because if somebody wants to aggress you, most likely psychologists will tell you that that guy maybe has some issue with his uh, self-esteem, you know, Maybe he feels uh, weak, so he needs to show that he can shout off on people, you know, show him, show he's an aggressive guy or something. You know, you are a far away from Sorin. Even I was surprised that he react on your video because he's a far away of his 
behind all, all those things. It's a pretty sad, but it is what it is. If you need this to feel great, then it's okay. It's your thing. Thank you for watching and see you on the next one. Bye.